Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Hope you guys are having an amazing week. I know it's beautiful out here in Chicago, Illinois. I'm having an amazing day so far. And I got my uh, my buddy with me, Saban. Hey, here. what's up guys? You guys can see behind me, there is a Model 3. This is the fully loaded Model 3, the performance model. We're gonna show you guys how to use the autopilot on this Model 3. So you guys can you know have a little more information if you guys plan on getting a Model 3 or if you guys already have one and want to know more features and stuff like that uh, using the autopilot we're going to show you guys i can't thank them enough for letting me do a review on this thing so uh, make sure you guys check them out if you guys are local in chicago and area uh, the customer service is amazing and they'll get you guys right if you guys want to do test drives or whatever and also as always you guys can check out tesla.com and they have tons you know of options different you can do different modes you can change the different colors and stuff like that you know shop away on their site so um other than that let's get into this video and always guys before we get started my goal right now is to get to 400 subscribers so let's, let's make this happen let's, get it, let's get it done let's get it done so let's get into this review let's hit the road all right guys so in order to do the autopilot you just press this once you get on the road we're not on the road yet but uh when we're on the road we'll we'll set all this up so let's put it in the drive right now so we just push down on this and we're gonna drive let's go about to hit the road right now Turning. so we're at a decent little speed right now and we'll just throw it into autopilot boom i'm in autopilot you guys can see right down here we're literally in autopilot right now you can see my speed and everything look at that beautiful now turning and eventually it just it just as soon as you touch the wheel a little bit it automatically goes out of uh, autopilot, autopilot. Right, so yeah. it's really it's a really cool feature and i know you did it a few times too and it was yeah it was pretty was fun it, it was yeah. pretty cool i mean honestly the first time you do it you get that sense of like um you know feeling that like oh my god am i gonna crash yeah, like, like there's no like way you'll be in mm -hmm. shock the first time you do it you'll be in shock Exactly. But then as you get it, it's actually, as you keep doing it, it's you like, start getting more comfortable. You get more used it, to it, yeah. more you comfortable. You start starting to trust the car yeah. and understanding, you know, all of its features and everything like that. Yep. As you guys can see, there's more autopilot features in here. Yeah, so, you know, stuff that you can mess around mm -hmm. with right here. Traffic light and stop. The reason why, I like, autopilot mode and Tesla does a really good job is because um, they have these sensors that can actually sense objects from mm -hmm. like uh, all think, different like, side and all different sides views too and all that and like i think it was like a couple yards away so as derek was going there was a car in front of us and uh we were at 50 and it slowly pushed it down slowly to 45 down. 35. We were, at a, we were at a higher speed than the speed limit we're at oh. 51 and it was slowly starting to slow down because we know that we're going pretty fast yeah so yeah so as we do this loop around we'll we'll go back to the speed and we'll pop it back into to autopilot but definitely this feature is very nice obviously for road trips residential areas mm -hmm. i mean you could still use it but you're going to be off and on it but definitely for road trips autopilot's perfect if you get tired this and that you know yeah so especially off. if you're like driving out for like let's say like you know a long road trip i'd do it all right guys so he's going to explain you on how to get to autopilot mode while you're driving so i'm going to get up to the speed right now so we're gonna do what 45 45 and so pushing down right now one two so Boom. the speed limit will turn blue and they'll show the maximum uh speed on how the car will go obviously and then the blue steering wheel will actually adjust the Look at steering that. wheel i'm literally uh, i'm hands free right now and you can see it's it knows exactly i'm driving perfectly straight see it is, splits yeah, off the pedal you see the speed limit and everything and all your features are right here shows the road look it shows a ups truck right there ups truck right here we're driving foots off the pedals off the pedal no controls no controls or anything and i'm slowly coming to a to a stop to a stop so he just adjusted it real quick Alright, so he's gonna explain it one more right, time so here for you guys. So remember, pick and speed up right now, and then always remember just push down two times. Twice, so down. One, two, okay, so and we're in. And then these both will be blue. Foot's off the pedal, hands off the There's wheel. a car in front of me, see? Cars in front of him, Tesla automatically brake. Automatically. 
He didn't even touch it or I didn't, anything. I didn't touch nothing, and it's going. That's pretty. That's pretty amazing. So there's a red light that's coming up right now, and I want to show you how exactly the model uh, three will, you know, adjust watching. to the speed and everything, right? So I'm gonna, you have to tell your mind. You have to. You have to trust the vehicle because uh, this is a hard situation. So right you're here. gonna trust the vehicle. Look, he has right. both foot off the pedal, and watch. There's a car in front of him. Watch the speed limit. As it gets closer, it will start braking that. slowly. You see, speed limit's gonna go down. There's a black Chevy um, in front of us. Chevy's braking, foot's off. Foot's totally off. Slowly, like, see, see? Miles per hour dropping down. Look at that. Just that like is that. crazy. Autopilot, you gotta trust it. Beautiful. And look, it's just washing almost right. It even shows, right? It shows, yeah. look at red. Shows the red light, shows that it's at zero miles per hour. And then we're gonna show you how it will adjust as soon as the light turns green. So we'll show you how it stopped, right? And now we'll show you how it will go. Yep, exactly. Just so that you guys can get an idea of like- Bigger, bigger understanding. You can see the, all the vehicles right here. Yeah. I mean, it's not listing the whole line, but I mean, you, it gives you a good idea. So as long as you just, as you're at a stop, you just turn a little so bit, look. just know it's awake. And so it turned green and watch. Slowly goes, Derek's foot's off the, you know, pedal. My hands are off. Hands are off, just going automatically goes. 27, going right 28, off. you got that green light over there. You got a good space between the Chevy and the Tesla, but sooner or later it's gonna pick up a little bit of speed to the maximum speed that you did set. It also does tell you the speed limit for the, um, yeah, the area you're in too. You can't go wrong with it, you know? I mean. So now not going out of it, you just take control of the vehicle and we're out. Yep. Easy. Just like that. It's pretty simple, but at first it will be hard just because you get that sense of fear of you know trusting yeah. the vehicle you really you this thing tesla you really have to trust the and vehicle. especially if you guys have if you guys never been in a tesla you guys are going to be like and nervous oh, your first time so yeah. nervous like how i know the first time i was driving it i got completely nervous like oh no i can't trust it but as you keep going you just start you feel the vehicle you start to understand it oh yeah and you know i trust it now so great car um yeah i mean go wrong you know you got more of your settings right here but that's pretty much it for the autopilot you know you can see right here you know speed limit warning stuff like that speed limit you know, it pretty much knows everything like right now we're in 35 so it shows 35 and then it just literally just shows you everything you know all you do is hit this one two times down and you're automatically into autopilot yep. quick and easy you know elon made it pretty simple very self-explanatory if you want to get out of autopilot obviously move the steering wheel or just hit the, it yep and if, you, the if, you, if you're at a stop and you just have to wake it up a little bit just to know you're you're alive or something at a stop. But other than that, highway, it's perfect to keep going, you know. Do you have anything to say? Overall, how do you like the feature of the autopilot? I mean, personally, the feature of the autopilot, you can't, you literally can't beat it, you know. Um, you can't go wrong, you know. It's like, it, it, I mean, it's like cruise control, you know, but the thing is, it, cruise control doesn't, you know, stop this and that. So you, you cruise control, you just keep going, you know. But this, it knows when to stop this and that. It keeps going, and you know, and you don't have to touch the steering wheel at all. So yeah. Right now I'm at I'm at 67, which the speed limit is 40, and you can see I'm an autopilot. Puts off the brake. I'm going a faster speed right now. So watch, now. watch the steering wheel. It'll slowly turn. Look at that, look at that. Look, see, it's slowly turned. Look, it's awesome. It's, watch, yeah. Yeah. Watch cars over there. Look it's slowly that. brake. Oh, oh my God. Brake. Look at that. Amazing, beautiful car. Okay, knew something that was in front of me ahead of time. Not even the pedal. Photos was off the pedal. Everything's off the pedal. I'm going straight. Amazing feature. Look at that. Yeah. Top speed, baby. <laughs> Throw it in uh, autopilot. Autopilot. No, Cars in front of us. The car will slowly break. Look I want. I want to know how it would turn. Let's say if I moved it this way. Oh. Automatically locks out. Oh. Like that. Yeah. Throw it back in. Automatically back in. Yeah. Beautiful. Look at that. Now we'll turn right here. Like just to press out of it. Easy. Quick and easy. Simple. 
simple, no problems right there. All right, guys, you guys can see that's how basically autopilot works. It's pretty, it's plain and simple. Uh, you know, you just have to get used to it. You know, that's the biggest thing. A lot of people don't trust themselves or uh, a lot of people don't trust the vehicle. Like, it gets hard, you know, you just have to still watch the road. Uh, Tesla's amazing, you know, it's, it's beautiful autopilot. Had a good time, right? This yep. thing's nice, right? Yeah. yeah. Awesome. But uh, yeah, guys, that's basically it on how to do the autopilot. So hopefully you guys, uh, if you guys have a Model 3, pretty much it's all the same setup for Model Y and uh, the Model 3 as well. But yeah, again, as always, shout out to Tesla in uh, Schaumburg, Illinois for letting me do a review on this Model 3 performance. Hope to see you guys on more videos to come. And make sure you guys subscribe as always. Trying to make it to 400 subs. Let's do it. And we out. Thank you.